I'm Evelyn Harley and I'm the owner of this farm that happens to have the abandoned Burger Baron on it. We tried to find the former owner, Naz, and we just have not had any luck with that. Well, I used to go to the Burger Baron. I used to plow the snow for the Burger Baron there and cut their grass and all that kind of stuff. Well, he was going to move it to Boyle at about 70 miles north. But he had to get the land first, eh? And he didn't get the land, so he couldn't move it there. He had no place to move it, so I let him move it here. And it's still here. Been here for 20 years. I never charged him no rent or nothing. And now the county has condemned the building and they want the building removed. They don't care where it goes. They just don't want it on their new highway because it's an eyesore. I tried and tried to get him to move it and he didn't get it moving. And the last time I phoned him up, he got mad and hung up the phone. And I have tried to give it away. The cost of moving this building would probably be about twenty dollars to $40,000, depending on how far you're moving it. My next option actually was going to be calling the fire department if they wanted a building to practice out of. Things fly at your head, I apologize. Oh, wow, there's a dead bird there. It has been decapitated. Uh, so I won't order the chicken. No. I never even thought anything about it because it was, you know, dad's friend, right? Yeah. And, oh, it's just going to be just for, you know, just a couple weeks. He's got somebody. So you're kind of like, okay. Because at that point, it was a nice building. It looked nice. There wasn't anything wrong with it. So you don't think anything of it. But then as time happens, right? It just kind of starts, you know, the roof starts leaking, pigeons start moving in, you know, the floor you can see is starting to cave in. I, I would describe it as a fixer-upper. Yeah, okay, that's a nice way of putting it. Was there ever a point when you would just like look at this restaurant on your property and think, you know, it would be kind of nice to run a little local cafe, no. a little restaurant, that, no. would, be, that would be a, a quaint <laughs> way no. to live? No, not never. There was never a no, point where you were like, no. let's make the best of it. No, no, <laughs> never, <laughs> never. We got the sink, we got scrubbies and knives and There's, things in it. They really yeah. were just like working in the restaurant until and the then, very end. 